Come on, Bill. Hey, let's sit down and talk a little bit. Boy, it's nice to get that finished, isn't it? It's always a pleasure to get the work done and enjoy the rewards. I hope I've given you a good picture of how to train your dog. I've shown you what, what the finished pro product should be, what you should expect from him, what you can expect from him. I've shown you, I hope, how to communicate with him. And I hope I've given you ample warning on, on the people problems, the people traps that you get in. Uh, as I said earlier, uh, that dog will practically train himself if you can keep away, keep your human nature in check and keep yourself from yelling at him, shouting at him, keep yourself from losing your temper, uh, keep yourself from testing him rather than training him. You always want to make it simple enough that, that, uh, that his training has adequately prepared him for it and, and thus he'll be successful rather than going out and seeing how hard you can make it every day to make a contest out of it. And if you follow, if you follow these basic principles, it's very easy to train a dog. It's, I think, I hope you've seen that it's simply logic and common sense and if you'll, if you'll apply the old child test to it, uh, if your child if you put it in terms that a four-year-old child that speaks Chinese could understand, then your dog will probably be able to understand it. Because he's at least that smart. You just have to be able to communicate to him. And I, I think we've covered that. Uh, I, I, I hope I got across to you that everything's based upon the obedience, that the retrieving is innate, inborn, and already in the dog. It doesn't need a whole lot of training. It's the control the obedience, the steadiness that needs the training. If you give him all that obedience and control training, it'll make him more pleasant to be with, a more pleasant companion. After all, that's what a, a hunting dog is for. Uh, number one, he should be pleasant to be with. And number two, he should bring all your birds back. And probably the most important thing is that he be pleasant to be with, which means well-mannered, under control, and obedient then he'll give you a, a long life of pleasure rather than being a pain in the neck. And with that, we'll close and wish you good hunting, good training. to be out of control.